Kevin Costner's estranged wife Christine Baumgartner has already received more than $400,000 to pay the costs of her legal battle with the actor. The mom of three is currently locked in a court fight with her ex over a fresh award of $855,000 to cover fees for the former couple's upcoming trial over whether the prenuptial agreement they signed 18 years ago can still be enforced. Baumgartner, 49, has asked for $575,000 to pay her lawyers John Rydell and Susan Wiesner and another $280,000 for her forensic accountant Jill Bombino, which would take the combined total to an eye-watering total of $1.26 million. But documents obtained by DailyMail.com reveal Baumgartner has so far already received $405,000 in legal, attorney, and forensic accounting fees, dispersed in July this year. In an excoriating legal filing lodged in court in Santa Barbara, California, on Tuesday, Costner's attorney Laura Wasser hit back at the whopping request, describing the fees as inflated and saying that it would be unconscionable for the Yellowstone star to be made to pay. Disso Queen Wasser also accused Baumgartner of being unreasonable and said her constant legal maneuvers, the majority of which have failed, have inflated costs for both parties. After receiving $405,000 in fees, including an award of $300,000 in legal fees, $200,000 in attorney's fees and $100,000 in forensic accounting fees, on July 12, and removing $105,000 for fees from Kevin's accounts, Christine is back requesting another fee award, Wasser writes in the filing. This time, she requests a whopping award of $885,000, $575,000 in attorney's fees and $280,000 in expert costs, just to prepare for the November-December bifurcated trial on one issue whether the spousal support waiver in the party's premarital agreement PMA, is unconscionable as of today. When the numbers are so large, it is easy to lose perspective of the actual value of these numbers. The new spat comes less than two weeks after a two-day evidentiary hearing over child support ended with Baumgartner having her payments slashed from $129,000 per month to $63,000. She had been requesting payments of $161,000 a month and, according to the new filing, turned down an offer made by Costner on June 30 of $75,000 a month because of her desire for a much larger payout.